everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Emily. I love macrame thrifting and a good DIY project. We are thrifting today. I'm under the weather, so I'm sounding groggy and husky. I am with my son, Olin. My babe is at home with my other babe. <laughs> My husband's watching my baby Norman right now. And you know what? I'm a breastfeeding mom and I don't enjoy pumping. So we are on a time limit. Got to get back in like an hour and a half. So let's not waste any time. Oh yeah. But first, if you're not already, follow me on Instagram at emilyfaith22. Okay, let's go inside. I don't have a plan. I just want to see if I can find anything. Yeah. This could make a cute upcycle project. <laughs> it's only a dollar fifty. That's not bad. <laughs> Tiny little DVD player. Anyone still watch DVDs? Mm, kind of a cool color, but an ugly chair. I feel like this has some really beautiful qualities to it. Looks like it's really well made and it's actually a really beautiful color. Like if you have a more like farmhouse style and need a coffee table, that would be awesome. Forty. Little mid-century looking dresser. Forty. My son getting into everything. You found a little boat. This is pretty. I don't even see how much that is. Oh, there it is. $8. That's pretty. That's an interesting basket. Wonder what that's for. Cute. They have a lot of handle baskets here. We don't really need those. Oh, that one would be good for a wall if you cut off the handles. Good for fruit. Little crafty things. Some nice large wooden balls. Cute. Cooking collections. Oh boy. Those are pretty colors. Some cool old, <laughs> old Nancy Drew books. How fun. Those are cool. You guys, I've never read this, but this movie, I love this movie. What? Those are your favorites? 
Have you guys seen The Giver? Let me know. I love that movie. Or have you read the book? Maybe the book's better. <laughs> what about Twilight? Always a classic. <laughs> What's that one? Ooh, mystery book. Look at this one. Oh, cool. These are really unique blouses. <laughs> this sweater may be worth trying on. A cool crochet top. Just found some really fun trousers. I don't think I would wear them, but I gotta show you guys. I think I'll try them on. We're in the change rooms. Got a stack, just a small stack. Two things hanging on the door. Ready to try on. These are the pants. <laughs> Don't mind my really nice underwear lines. I don't love them. They're cool. But I don't love them. This is too tight on my arms. It's not terrible. This is pretty. Little sleeves. I don't know. This is super cool. But it's really, it's like kind of itchy. So I don't know. Just got out of there. I think we're gonna stop at this really small thrift store. I don't know if I'm gonna film in there because I am on a major time crunch. But I will head home after that and show you guys everything. We're home. It's actually the next day. It just worked out easier for me to film this morning. And I want to show you guys the two things I picked up. You already saw them. But the funny thing about them is that I'm actually, I don't think I'm going to keep them. Sometimes I've been selling my clothes at this like consignment shop in town. And I thought these were such good pieces. I didn't want to pass them up. So I hope you still find this enjoyable anyways. But... I love this sort of like flannel type jacket. It is, um, I'm pretty sure it's vintage. It says the Woolrich Woman. And yeah, I just think the colors are super cool. It's really like good quality. It's a smidge tight on my shoulders. I feel like it might be better for somebody else. I thought this was a really, really great find. I think it was $6. Six dollars or eight dollars, I can't remember. But either way, for this like vintage flannelly jacket, I thought that was an awesome find. And then I did end up getting those pink pants. I realized in my try on, I rolled them. I should have showed you guys them unrolled because they are so cool. I just felt like somebody would love these and they'd fit them perfectly. And I loved this color and I think they're such a fun pant. And I think if I wasn't wearing like jeans and sweatpants all the time, um, maybe I would keep them, but I just don't think I would ever wear them because I'm not gonna wear these <laughs> walking to the park with my children, if you know what I mean. But they're super fun and I'm really glad I picked these up. These I got for $3, so that was a steal. The other day I was at the same thrift store and I, found this mirror. I actually asked you guys on Instagram if I should get it and you guys totally said yes. So I picked it up and I wanted to give it a little upcycle with the help of my husband. So let me show you this mirror and I'll show you guys what we did. Here's the mirror. I really, really liked it. I don't love this shelf though. So 
I took everything apart, took off the shelf, took off the back, kind of got a good look at it. And then my husband took this shelf and measured it, <laughs> did what he did. I don't know, I let him do it. We decided to cut the shelf just to be like a thin piece of wood. I thought that the shelf looked really dated. Some of you might like it, but I wasn't a fan. So he basically cut it down to size. I went in and sanded the rough edges. And because I didn't feel like staining and doing all of that, I just took some white paint and painted over the part that was the light wood from where it was cut. I thought that would be just kind of a fun touch. I first went in with white and I didn't show this, but later I went in with a color called warm white. I thought the white was too stark white, so I did cover this again with a warm white. And then on the ends, I decided to go in with this terracotta color and just paint the ends. I thought it would be a fun little touch of color. Then all that was really left to do was to put the mirror back together, screw it all back in, add our cut shelf, which is no longer a shelf. And of course we did do a final clean on the mirror, make sure it looked good. And here's the finished product. I am so happy with how this mirror turned out and these two pieces of clothing that I found. I hope you guys enjoyed today's Come Thrift With Me and this little thrift flip. If you did, feel free to give this video a thumbs up. As always, you guys can subscribe for more of my everyday life. Follow me on Instagram at emilyface22. I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you next time.